Hello again, my name is Rodney Reynolds and welcome to another video review. Today I'm looking at the OC's Ad DDR PC 3200 2GB dual channel memory kit. The speed on this memory is 400 MHz DDR or PC 3200 and has a CES of 3. Now what does DDR and CES mean? DDR stands for double data rate and that means it doubles the bandwidth of the memory by transferring data twice as fast on both the rising and the falling of the clock cycle. CES stands for column access select or column access strobe and that essentially means the number of cycles for the memory to get information and then process that information. Also keep in mind that a lower CES is much better than a higher CES. For example, a CES of 2 will result in better memory performance than 2.5 or three. So try and keep the CES as low as possible when overclocking. This memory is also dual channel which means better overall memory bandwidth resulting in superior performance. In order to benefit from this technology you will need to have a dual channel motherboard. Non-dual channel motherboards do not have two fully independent 64-bit memory controllers but dual channel boards do which means they have a 128-bit memory interface. Now this memory will work on non-dual channel motherboards but the overall performance will be much less at the same megahertz. This memory comes in a 2 gigabyte kit that's two sticks of 1 gigabyte each. Again it's PC3200 or 400 megahertz DDR at 2.6 volts. The timing on this memory is 3, 3, 3 and 8 and it does have the ultra low noise 2 technology it's unbuffered memory with a lifetime warranty and it comes with copper heat spacers and that does help dissipate the heat Two gigabytes of memory, well, is a lot of memory. Quite frankly, a lot more than the average current computer user needs. However, if you're into really highly memory intensive software, and there's lots of it out there, people probably need this much and more. But again, for the current computer user, you really only need a maximum of one gigabyte of memory, and that will get you through the latest operating systems, the latest applications, as well as the latest games. Also, with regards to the timing on this memory, well, it's a little high at 3, 3, 3, and 8. However, this memory does overclock to 490 megahertz DDR. Overall, this is a kick-ass product. Again, my name is Rodney Reynolds, and this has been another video review. Be sure to check back very soon. I will have a brand new one for you then. Also, pop into my website at www.3dgameman.com. And while you're there, you can go into the forums and register. And remember, registration is completely free. Also, keep in mind, you can find out a lot more on this product in the forums. And as a final note, if you love watching my video reviews, please help support 3dgameman.com. Until the next time, take care. Yeah.